The prosecutor's office identified 25-year-old Devin Carter as the owner of the white SUV involved in the drive-by shooting Saturday. And according to court documents, he told police that he was celebrating his birthday in Westport when a fight started at the nightclub before his group left. Surveillance video captured uh, Carter's SUV driving down Mill Street. And at one point, someone was standing out of the sunroof shooting from the top of the vehicle. Another person hanging outside of the the passenger side window also shooting a firearm. Police caught up with Carter and found his SUV on Main and 39th where he was taken into custody and is now facing felony charges for that shooting. And the incident happening in Westport is frustrating for residents and city leaders. It's terrible uh, and it's, it's really unfortunate that people can't find a better way to resolve their differences uh, than by um, you know, continuing this cycle of violence. We have too many people that are involved in violent crime both as victims and as assailants who we might have a hunch might be inclined to hit back but we're not doing enough to engage those groups I think each week and after each incident. And there you heard the mayor just talking this weekend about ideas on how to address gun violence generally. And clearly other people were involved in this shooting. Surveillance video actually caught people leaving Carter's SUV and getting into some other vehicles. So there are still many more questions to be answered and much work to do on this investigation. And to give you a sense of the firepower used in this shooting, police found 95 used shell casings in the area where this shooting happened.